So I got a package in this week. Let's see here. Uh, this one's from Larson Lights out of western Minnesota. He sells LED headlights for tractors and trucks and other equipment, some interior lights as well. Look at them. See, there's 10 lights in this package here. We're putting them on our 9130 International, Case International Steiger. There's uh, 12 headlights on the tractor, but uh, they've already changed the two in the, in the grill. So this is for the rest of them. There's going to be six pointing to the rear and six pointing to the front. But uh, yeah, so that's what I'm going to be working on tomorrow. Talk to you later. So I wanted to do a before new headlights shot and an after shot. But wouldn't you know it, we have a full moon tonight. So it kind of distorts the image, but as a, this tractor already has LEDs in the grill. So it has two forward facing LEDs already. Um, I'm going to be adding one more here on the nose. Or I should say, replacing this one on the nose and replacing this one on the cab. These are the forward-facing. We have a total of six forward-facing lights, but it, you can see we have pretty good lighting up front from them. You know, I'm going to take a peek back at the tractor, and you can see those two, two grill lights. They just they just overpower all of the rest. But uh, I'm going to do an after shot once I get get the other lights put in. Again, here's, here's what it looks like facing forward at this time. And then um, on the rear, it also has six lights. And here's kind of a, you know, shot looking back. You can see it's, it's kind of dark back here compared to what we've, we've all been, uh, I wouldn't say accustomed to, but we've been spoiled into but yeah, that's the, the lighting of the rear of the tractor got two on the cab and then four in the fenders facing rearward I'm gonna be replacing them all so we're gonna have six LEDs facing forward and six LEDs facing rearward tomorrow but I just wanted to do a before and after shot So I'm doing an after shot video of replacing the headlights in this 9130 Steiger we have. If you can see here, this is this is an after shot. We're looking forward again. Here, here's our here's the tractor. We've got uh, two in the nose, and actually in two in the grill, two on the sides of the nose, and then two on the front top of the cab facing forward. You can see the take a look back here at the blinding light we have now and then we also have six in the bird in the back We've got four on e two on each fender and one on the top of the cab facing facing the back again and it's it's almost like daylight out here. Since we've been putting these LEDs on, and it's here, here's a here's a view over the rear. Since we've been putting these LED lights on these tractors, it's almost more fun to work work the fields at night than it is during the day. Let's take a look at it from inside the cab. See what see what we see as as we're going down the field. <clears throat> Well, there's our forward view. And you can just, <laughs> it's just like driving in the day. And it's just as bright out the back. You can see what to, see what you're pulling and seeing if you're having trouble. 
So, and there's another project complete. Well worth it. We purchased these lights from Larson's Lights. They're out of uh, Western Minnesota. We bought all of our LEDs from them. Or excuse me, from them, yeah. And we've been very happy. So we have the 766 lit up, our 1486 lit up, our 3788 lit up, and now our 9130. All with LEDs. That's the warning buzzer. Well, thanks for watching. Everybody have a great day.